they play against France. France, they have to win. They expect them to win. Australia have nothing to lose. In four years ago, I was on the plane actually watching the game against France and they missed, they actually did really well. Uh, they could have got, they should have actually probably got a draw. In terms of quality, they're, nah, they're not on, on their level, they're not on that level or something. They obviously qualified, I think people didn't expect them to, to get qualified, so you gotta give them respect for that. Anything can happen, look, in football, you, anything, you, a red card after 15 minutes, uh, one goal, everything, anything can happen. The pressure, there's no pressure on Australia. Like, they play against France, France, they have to win, they expect them to win. Australia have nothing to lose. I don't know, to be honest, if you look at the players, everything, and the quality of the team, they're not, obviously, in my opinion, they're not on that level, but anything can happen in the World Cup, so I don't know. Um, if I look at the four teams, I would say, Tunisia is better. They actually, in my opinion, Tunisia are actually better than, than Australia in terms of quality and the players. But in one game, of course, Australia can beat Tunisia. And Tunisia can beat France and Denmark can, beat, can finish first. So I wouldn't be surprised if, even if Denmark finishes first. They beat France two months ago or something like that. So yeah, 